big kid with a new bike. Tell me a little bit about the bike. Uh, 2018 Kawasaki. I wanted a 18 or 19 bike because uh, I got national champion on uh, this model of Kawasaki in 18. So uh, I know it really well. And I contacted my old team owner back in Denmark about my suspension settings and some other stuff. I'm gonna need some, some parts for it and it's gonna take me some time to build it, but uh, that's how it is. Also, the older bikes here, they have the old Showa suspension with single spring forks and another shock than the new 19 have, and I like that better than Kayaba. So, pretty happy, found this one. 2018, only five hours on it. Pretty amazing here, if you take a look down here on the, on the, on the bolts, still have the paint, painting on in here. And it come from stock. Also on the triple cram, you can see have never ever touched, touched the balls on it. So original grips. Original grips. But the other thing is that he has not been too good of a cleaning boy. So uh -oh. oh shit. So it definitely needs a a turn down job, and then I have to make it nice and make it ready for some nationals. Whoop. Me and the team we got to an agreement, and I'm. Leaving the team so I can go private here again and uh, have a bigger, bigger benefit for me, I think. I can do what I want, when I want, write with the parts I want. I already got uh, small deals with some companies. Still need some clutch, triple clamp, foot picks. I actually like the stock foot picks. I, li I don't like the wide picks. I like the ones that is more narrow. But they're gonna tear down fast because it's not titanium, so I gotta find a solution for that. Triple clamp, gonna change the handlebar, some other grips, tires I don't know yet, suspension we keep stock, I need some chain brand, filler, oil. If we take a look over here on the on the shell, here this is this is my girlfriend's shell. <laughs> she's, she's, she has a sponsor, she sponsors by my tool. And this is my shell. That's the boyfriend shell. That's, <laughs> that's the boyfriend shell. <laughs> I have some left over soap and uh, shine. And then I have some BD40 <laughs> from Home Depot. And then I have some engine degreaser for my sprinter. So it's pretty empty here. So I definitely need a uh, hookup for some oil and cleaner and all that shit. But we will see how it comes along. Also need a pipe sponsor. I'm gonna tear this one down. Grease it, clean it, polish it. I'm gonna make it look nice. <laughs> Not much left here. Okay, thank you very much. I appreciate you calling me. You got it. Ready to clean? Ready to fucking clean. The old toothbrush. <laughs> Can I ask what you're doing right now? Factory secrets. <laughs> to all the guys out there with a the Kawasaki, when these ones get worn out too fast, you have to cut a little bit of the knife here with all the buildings and the swing arm to get the to get the rubber closer to the swing arm here. Helps a lot. Oh, yeah. Almost half a bike. Almost half a bike. 
Just missing some parts now. I'm gonna run the X trick triple clamp. Got a deal in with FMF pipes, recluse clutch we need. Everything has been completely assembled, greased up. So Let's what have we been doing until now? Fuck, everything uh, has been turned completely back down. All wire harness have been on, have been greased all up, all bearings. I've been glass blasted, the whole frame, the whole engine. Yeah. Making deals with new sponsors and partners and make sure you're doing something too. <laughs> yeah, I held two screws today. Oh yeah, three screws. Three screws, good job. Good job. <laughs> Bigger than stock, stronger than stock. And cheaper, cheaper than stock. So, what is the difference with the bigger and stronger radiator? Uh, I don't know how to say it in English. <laughs> this is like a formed in aluminium powder, and then they heat it up, and then it transfers into a radiator. And this is like cut it into pieces and build it together. And this is like pressed together, so you see it is not welded. So this one is is welded and stronger. Thicker. So I picked out some grips for Matthias here. I decided that he can choose which one he wants to use. Which one do you like best? I go all in. All in. All in. <laughs> if I don't make the qualifying for the first motos, the first round, I'm gonna run pink grips the rest of the season. Deal? Deal. <laughs> About X trig. Well, like, what's the difference between that and the, the one I have? This one is green. Looks nice. Now I may I do this choice because I want my handlebar in the middle of the forks, and I'm not allowed to do that on the stock triple clamps. But here you have three different choices where you want your handlebar, um. and I want it in the middle of my suspension. So what parts are we waiting for now? Fucking one grip up. Oh, oh, oh. There's the one. <laughs> Scandinavian mate. ready for the dyno tomorrow so I don't want to put a brand new build engine on the dyno without just being warmed up a little bit so mm -hmm. curious to see how it goes yes so is the bike completely ready now almost yeah we need just some graphics and we need a package from the clues and yeah, some small stuff but civil like all frame wise handling Power, it's good. Have some ODI handlebars, grips, extra plan. Suspension is done. Yep, 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 yep. Just um, original suspension for the season for now. Original suspension. Just how you like it. I love it. <laughs>
Gonna do good? Gonna do fucking good. Yeah. Next up, Utah. Utah. Let's get it done. <laughs> 